Hey everyone, my name is Kyle. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a fantastic day. So in today's video, I'm going to react to the She-Hulk trailer. I'm really, really excited to check this trailer out. I'm pretty sure I think it might be another new MCU TV series, which is pretty awesome. I'm really enjoying all these um, MCU Marvel trailers so far. I uh, mean, series. The only, maybe the complaint I have is that it's kind of short, like... It's like six to nine episodes, so it's like, I feel like I just get into the series and it's like done. So it's like, I'm not sure if I'm the only person that feels like that. Um, maybe because I kind of get, it takes me one or two episodes, maybe at least two episodes to get into the series a little bit because I'm so unfamiliar with the characters and stuff. And then if it's six episodes, it's like I'm already like a third done of um, the series and I'm kind of just getting started to like in the series or... So I haven't really made up my mind of whether I like it or not until like after the second or third episode. Um, but yeah, I'm not sure if I'm the only person like that. But yeah, I decided to wear green because obviously with the theme of Hulk, I kind of wish I wore a green shirt shirt when I was uh, watching The Incredible Hulk, but I don't really have a, I didn't have a lot of green shirts at the time. Um, also, you, as you can tell, that I am in a new room right now, and I'll do a little bit of a life update and a separate video, because obviously you guys are here to watch the trailer reaction uh, to She-Hulk. And yeah, I'm also going to be finishing up Moon Knight as well, so do not worry, I just have to finish editing all the other videos and all that stuff, so it, it is coming. Um, please do not worry, and before I get started with this video, make sure you subscribe to the channel, hit the notification button, follow me on my social medias, so it'll be linked in the description box down below. And if you're interested in watching my full length reaction and supporting this channel, you can go over to my Patreon. The link for Patreon will be linked in the description box down below. And without further ado, let's get into this video. Being a superhero. Ooh, Bruce Banner's in this too. Interesting. A trial by fire. Who's gonna protect the world if not people like you? Ooh. There's She-Hulk. Ooh, that's cool. I wonder how Oh, that's cool. I'm a lawyer. I have great friends. Can we get some shots, please? It's an emergency. <laughs> uh, demanding job. We just started a superhuman law division, and I want you to be the face of it. Interesting. A frustrating family. Cause we didn't ask for this, but just still. That's cool. We can see Bruce Banner again. Triggered by anger and fear. Those are like the uh. baseline of any woman just existing. <laughs> oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> That's the point, I think. <laughs> yes. Ooh. No. No. <laughs> no. August seventeenth. Oh, cool. Anonymous lawyer. Can you tell us where She-Hulk is? Jen, you're a story now. Girl, your ass looks crazy right now. <laughs> <laughs> you could be an Avenger. Oh, I'm not. She a might be an Avenger soon. That is for billionaires and narcissists and adult. Orphans for some reason. <laughs> oh, abominations in the two. Is there anything <laughs> more depressing than dating in your thirties? Yeah. <laughs> I've had in a while. Oh. Oh. We split some fries. Let's get those to go. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness, that's funny. <laughs> So yeah, that was the teaser trailer for She-Hulk. Really, really interesting. I I don't know why I wasn't really expecting to see a Bruce Banner in the Abomination. So this is going to be really freaking cool to see Bruce Banner again. It's been a while since we've seen him. So it's going to be cool to see what he's been up to since like post-Endgame. It almost seems that like every other MCU series we've experienced besides Moon Knight so far. I have I still have to watch the last episode. They were always talking about relating back to Endgame and what they've been kind of up to and stuff. And so it's kind of cool for us as the audience members to experience that with the characters. So it's gonna be cool to see that perspective and they might just like dive into it like a little bit and then because maybe that's not obviously not the whole point of the the series. Um, and I wonder how she, like, gets her powers, so it almost seems that, like, she's, wor like, it uh, didn't say, like, I'm assuming she might be working for S.H.I.E.L.D., but maybe not, uh, because S.H.I.E.L.D.'s not, like, the greatest people, because uh, they've made Hydra and stuff, so I, I doubt that, but maybe some other 
like, new, like, government organization that she's working as an attorney for, but I want to know how she, like, gets her powers, in a sense, because it's a very similar to Bruce Banner, where there was the experiment, um, where they, like, he injected himself, well, they were doing some experiment, and he injected himself with, like, the, the, I forget what it's called, but I feel like it might be something very similar to that, or she or she's already already had the powers for a while, because they might it'd be interesting to to um, it'd be really interesting for them to show us a different way of how she got the powers because if it's like the exact same way that Bruce Banner got it, um, I don't think people would be um, would en would enjoy it as much. I feel like She Hulk has to be slightly different than the Hulk that we're used to. So that's gonna be pretty cool. I like how they also mentioned the Avengers. So it almost seems that like, like I was seeing in my other se reactions to the other Marvel series, it almost seems that like they're hinting at some bigger projects coming ahead. So I, I think that having these like mini series to give us the audience some context of their character, I think it's gonna build on to something bigger that they may be announcing later on. And so that just makes sense to me that they would be, that She-Hulk might be, and an Avenger soon, um, and and it's gonna be really really cool. I I don't I'm not really exactly familiar with She-Hulk. I think she might have some like comic stuff, but I'm not. I haven't read the comics, so I'm not sure of like super super details about her. I'd be interesting to see like who is this m villain guy or girl that we're gonna be that that she has to. Um, combat with and so in, I think that if you maybe know the comics they like you might kind of know or have a hint like they, they may have showed it in the trailer and maybe I didn't pick it up but if you read the comics it's right there in your face as a teaser so this is gonna be really cool um I wonder how many episodes it's gonna be and um yeah it, it's kind of cool how they it always seems that like since obviously Bruce Banner is really smart, and then she linked up with Bruce, and so there's probably they're working together on this project, and then they kind of maybe he's like helping her control her powers and all like that. There is maybe a, another purpose behind it besides the project they're working at, and then she knows that he is Hulk, so and she might have obviously similar powers to to him. So maybe Bruce is kind of helping her along the way, which is gonna be pretty cool and I'm super super excited and yeah this kind of just wraps up my trailer reaction and my little just review about or like my initial thoughts about this trailer thank you so much for watching this video I sincerely appreciate it also I want to hear what you think about this trailer like, do you are you excited for this trailer are you a little bit maybe disappointed or um do you enjoy She-Hulk as a superhero I'd really love to hear from you and please leave a comment down below and uh, I'll see everyone in Moon Knight episode 3. And I just have to finish editing that. And yeah, I'll see everyone in the next video. Peace out. Bye.